Hey everybody, welcome back to the Outcomes Rocket. Saul Marquez here. I'm so excited to have Joe O'Brien with us, head of sales for LG Digital Health. Joe, thanks for joining us. Thanks all for having me. Pleasure. Hims 2024, we are here. It's live, it's bustling. Tell us a little bit about LG Digital Health, what you guys do, and what main stakeholder in the health system you guys are helping. Yeah. But, uh, Great way to start off. So we're very exciting at LG Digital Health. We've been at it for nearly two years now. Uh, the, the aha moment for LG came as we realized we had a very strong presence already in the health systems, long-term care facilities, with our TVs, right, in the patient room. And so with the core gaps in care around patient experience, uh, provider shortages, staff burnout, it was our opportunity to, to get in, dive in head first into the digital health space and create clinical applications to address those gaps in care uh, by activating those inpatient room TVs for digital interactions between the provider and the patient. So, uh, you know, it's, it's a starting point for us uh, and, and really have a lot of big plans to go beyond the health system walls. Love it. Yeah, you know, that, that health system real estate, you know, inside of the roofs, it's a big deal. And ha already having a footprint there, it's what a smart move to say, how can we help? How can we do more? Uh, here at NIMS 2024, there's a lot of talk, a lot of bustle, there's a lot of words like AI and, and you know innovation. What's been the biggest aha moment for you here, and why is it that you guys chose to come? Well, HIMSS is the conference of all conferences in healthcare. It's got uh, you know staying power and and a lot of reputations in terms of the the access, the the thought leadership that takes place, and and really just the conversations. It's very enlightening for us and. We learn quite a bit. Uh, we're always seeking you know, education around our product, but also what new challenges systems are facing. And so for us, it reinforces what we're already doing and where our focus should be. Uh, I think one of the key takeaways I've found is uh, the hospital at home is really more closer to a reality than maybe we previously thought a year ago or two years ago. Hey, that's really interesting, Joe. So help us understand, right? I mean, the presence in the hospitals, obviously in the homes, what kind of uh, uh, involvement or plans do you guys have at LG Health around that? Yeah, so we're looking really, I mean, to lean into health systems to help build our roadmap with clinical feedback, uh, understanding where their you know, short-term gaps are, long-term gaps are, but uh, it seems that the track is leading towards the home, right? And, and we're now regulations, state regulations are starting to back those initiatives. And so it's really, you know, the timing is now. And you know, with the clinical feedback that we're developing with systems in the patient room, we can apply that to the home and make that a reality. As we know, baby boomers are aging. You know, they want to be in the home. They want to have their connectivity with their providers in their space. And so we, we feel confident at LG that we've got that footprint to, to uh, make that a reality. Yeah, and you know, um, you, you think of a brand like LG, you think yeah. consumer. And, and, and a big part that's been missing in healthcare is that consumer first range. Uh, can you comment on that? Yeah, I mean, it's even we get caught up in, you know, the provider and staff kind of workflows, right? And making their lives easier, but it all flows back to the patient experience. So that has a ripple effect across the system and into, you know, the realities of a, of a consumer, right? right? As far as how we engage with our phones, how we engage with, you know, everyone in the digital space, but primarily that healthcare one-to-one -one, uh, focus is really a, um, an emphasis that we are really looking to hone in on and, and make sure that patient experience is not disrupted once they leave the health system and go to the home. So a lot of focus is on that transition from discharge to the home and how we stay connected to the patient. Love it. Thank you, Joe. You know, um, everybody out there is, that didn't get a chance to be here at hands is, is looking for those insights and calls to action. So what would you leave our audience with as far as call to action and what's the best place they could learn more about you and LG Digital Health? Yeah, I think the call to action is that you're, you're, you're probably a lot closer than you think to some of these projects that you're looking at around AI or interoperability, the hospital home. So continue down that path. Look for, for, look for partners that are already you're familiar with that have a plan to make that you know, a custom fit for your, your system and your, you know, your environment, your communities. Uh, and you can learn more about LG Digital Health on all our socials. We're active at a lot of conferences. And so, uh, yeah, looking forward to engaging and continuing the conversations this week at HIMSS. Awesome. Joe, thank you very much. And everybody listening and watching us today, make sure you check out the show notes where we'll have ways that you can get in touch with Joe and his team at LG Digital Health. The opportunity is now, as he said, 
So take advantage of that, uh, those links below to get in touch. Joe, thanks for being with us. Thanks, Al. Appreciate it.